Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Tracy. If this is your first time tuning in, today I will be doing another try out haul. I haven't done one of these in months. I did the Gymshark one a couple of months ago and you guys loved it. And you asked me guys to do some more, but like, I really be spending my own coin for these. I'm not sponsored. <laughs> so unless people sponsor me, then I'll probably only do them when I do a lot of shopping like I have now. So right now I've been collecting a couple of pieces that are a little more timeless. I'm trying not to buy fast fashion anymore. By fast fashion I mean, you know those trends that just come and go. Like, I'm trying to buy pieces I could wear over time, over years, and even those that I can transition into the winter time. I know we're still in summer, but fall's coming around soon in a couple of months, maybe around two months. So I want pieces I can layer up dress up dress down just pieces I could wear for a long time not just once off you know cuz hey this economy <laughs> so yeah I did quite a little bit of shopping and I'll just show you guys what I got I hope you guys enjoy this video please subscribe to my channel if you enjoy this and comment down below if you want to see some more of this type of content I will see what I can do and um, yeah with that further ado let's get straight into it I'll start with the shoes because I only got one pair of shoes. So I was looking for like a heeled sandal. I've been seeing these shoes all over Instagram. Everybody and their auntie is wearing them this summer. They are so cute. And I thought maybe not so timeless, but I thought it would just be a nice casual shoe to wear for brunch or for, I don't know, for us to be go lunch. Even for dinner, you can dress it up and just make it look cute comfortable so i saw this off the asos website in the black but i wanted it a different color so i went to the actual website it's by raid and i saw them in white and nude and i thought i'd pick out the white but the only thing is i don't know if that was a wise decision because i actually don't have many outfits that'll go with white shoes or maybe i'm just not creative like that but even aside that they don't fit me so i got them in a size five this is a shoe i got them in a size five not that they don't fit but my toes feel a little bit squished like this stringy detail is quite quite uncomfortable and the heel, not so bad, really, really comfortable. I think you could wear this for hours because of the shape. My only thing is I don't like the way my toes fit. So I'm actually not going to film this like overlay to show you how they fit on my feet because I don't like the way they be looking on my feet. They're not that comfortable. So I really won't be doing that. But um, yeah, if you like these, I'll try and link everything in the description box. If I forget, please remind me in the comment section and I'll do that for you. Otherwise, uh, nah, I'll probably be returning these. I think I can get a better heeled sandal shoe for the purpose I want in a different color as well. Maybe like a nude. I really like nudes in case you can't tell. In like a nude color, I think that would be really, really cute and with a lot more comfort than these because this... Hmm, nah, it's a no for me. <laughs> okay, now I'll move over to the Fashion Nova items. I usually shop on Fashion Nova at least once a year. I think they have really good summer pieces. If we're talking like Instagram type of stores, like your pretty little thing, misguided, those type of stores. I like Fashion Nova. I think they have really cute pieces. My only thing is because I'm in the UK it's not easy to get returns one i have to pay for my own returns two they will not refund my account but rather they give gift cards i don't like that <laughs> sometimes i be impulse shopping and i need my cash back <laughs> don't give me no 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 hey i'm gonna listen to my words don't give me no gift card <laughs> don't give me no gift card but that's just what they do so you need to get the sizes right with that if you're in the UK at least, just to avoid all the hassle of trying to get your things back. But um, yeah, so I got a couple of pieces. I will start with this bodysuit. I actually wore this yesterday. It's called the Tony bodysuit in nude and I got it in a size small. I really, really like the material, nice and stretchy and it's nude. <laughs> It's nice stretchy material. I can't believe I had don't have like a nude bodysuit like this. I think this is like an essential. The back is a little bit low, not so bad, but 
really really nice and basic you can layer this up with like a blazer for like a more sophisticated look or even if you're like someone who goes to work i think like with the pantsuit and you just throw this on the inside as the inner top that would be stunning 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 now in the summertime i'd probably just wear this with a pair of jeans blue jeans or a pair of shorts blue shorts even what else can i wear a skirt literally anything you're good to go something's about to fall hold on literally literally a staple i think everyone needs like a nude bodysuit you can literally wear this with anything so yeah i got this in a size small it was ten dollars 34. um i like it it's probably my favorite piece <laughs> i'm very very basic in case you can't tell now the next piece i got is the visions clear top in white I got it in a size small, so it just looks like this. I don't even have to say much about this. This is just an ordinary t-shirt with some graphics in the front. I like these type of t-shirts. Like, I love, 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 love this. And the fit, it's like, um, it's quite fitted. So I feel like it's like a very basic t-shirt that still shows your body. Because more times, like when I wear oversized tees, like the one I'm wearing, this is from Zara Men oversized he's like the one where you don't really see my figure but this is very very good for like an everyday type of look i just wear this when i'm going to the grocery store literally anywhere i go i just wear this it a, makes a great statement and um yeah I throw on a blazer maybe for like a coffee date type of thing not like a coffee date like a date date <laughs> but like you know just one of them ones you're meeting up with a friend in a coffee shop i like it i like it a lot i like this t-shirt a lot and then the next bodysuit i got from fashion nova i was quite disappointed in this one i think it is the most expensive item in this haul but it doesn't look like it do you see i don't think it's worth it it was 18 dollars 75 with the prices actually i'm not sure if this is the original price because i did get a coupon code so my prices went down so i don't know if what they're showing me is the price before the coupon code or after I don't remember but I'll try and put the details in the description box if I remember but yeah this is just like a one shoulder um it really doesn't look like this on the website I'm sorry it really doesn't the material and this doesn't look the same at all at all also I was a little concerned like when I tried it on in the breast area you could easily have a nip slip moment so you need to wear a good bra but you also have to be careful so the bra doesn't show on this it's just a complicated bodysuit i think this wasn't worth the purchase honestly i would have returned this if it was easy to return i would have returned this but um yeah i'd wear this with like a pair of shorts maybe even jeans for a more dressier look but very much daytime because of the material it's quite the you know that cotton cotton i don't know if you can tell but um, very much a daytime look. I wouldn't wear this in the evening. I hoped I would, like when I originally bought it. But looking at it, mm, nah, no, it's just a daytime type of piece. And then the last item from Fashion Nova was a dress. I got this, it's called a spacing out tie-dye mini dress in the color mint combo. And I got it in a size small for $16.38. Oh, so many distractions i ran out of space i hope you can hear the noise outside by the way i live near a train station and it's very loud and i'm filming during the day because of the lights the natural lighting but um yeah so this dress i got this in a size small i thought it was a nice everyday type of dress i'm really really into tie-dye i love 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 tie-dye is this timeless maybe not i think tie-dye comes in and out but I think it's been in for a couple of years now maybe two years because last summer i remember raving over tie-dye as well so i thought this was a nice jersey dress the only thing is it has this whole detail and i don't know if you can see it's got like tiny tiny dots so it looks like holes in it i find that a little bit childish i'm not gonna lie i couldn't really see that on the picture on the website so I feel like I was deceived. I would have never bought it if I knew it had these tiny, tiny holes. I just find it a little childish. Like, <laughs> like this wouldn't have been childish if it wasn't for the dots. But maybe it won't show like in pictures from far. I don't know. And I could easily like turn it into like a crop top, do some DIY in the future. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But I just thought it was a cute summer piece. I'm really, really into these type of colors, pinks 
purple, blue, blah, 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 love these colors. The next item I got is an ASOS design high-rise skinny shorts in black. I got them in a UK size 10 and they were 20 pounds. So they're just a very staple shorts like this. I've really been into wearing shorts this summer. I never used to, but this summer I have enjoyed wearing shorts. I think it's a gym games coming through. <laughs> but I really, really enjoyed wearing denim shorts. I think this is also quite timeless. Last year, these shorts were in fashion. They just sit literally by your thigh a very good stable piece um the only thing i do regret about buying these is i wish i got like a lighter wash i think because of how dark the denim is it's a little bit hard to appreciate that they are denim shorts um they easily look like biker shorts or cycling shorts i don't know whatever you call them but yeah that's my only critique of the shorts otherwise love 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 them and as a thick girl hey look at that stretch my hips sit here nicely my waist is snatched i'm not even asking for a lot bro like if every company would make clothes that fit like this for thick women we would be happy we would be happy oh <sighs> But yeah, no, I love them. I really, really like them. I haven't worn them out yet. I think I'd wear them like for a daytime casual look with a t-shirt, some shorts, sneakers, good to go. Even dresses up with a bodysuit, some heels, a cute bag, good for brunch. Literally, this you can dress up or down. It's up to you. But a very, very good staple piece of short that everyone needs to have in the closet, I think. Now we move on to the most frustrating part, which is the denim so i was looking for some mom jeans yeah um like some blue washed mom jeans as i don't have mom jeans in blue do i no, no no i actually don't own a lot of blue denim most of my denim is black so i'm trying to step away from that especially in the summertime like i don't really want to be wearing black so i got these from misguided so the blue high-waisted comfort stretch denim mom jeans and i got them in a size 10 and they were 25 pound 20. i think they're a stunning page pair of jeans look at how stunning that is oh even with this t-shirt and this blonde hair ah how it looks so freaking cute so freaking cute and the design at the back it's just a staple it looks like a you know oh i can't even explain them but i think they are so so stunning but they are so uncomfortable it's not the first time i've tried to buy mom jeans as a thick girl so i know that we do have mom jeans that fit that are comfortable but these are not comfortable at all like i feel a little bit trapped in them like really really trapped in them so i don't know if i'm gonna keep them but i really really like the wash i think it's such a such a beautiful wash of denim quite a staple which i don't have in my closet i don't have my closet and i could wear this all year round not just in the summertime in the winter throw on some boots oh a puffer jacket it just looks so 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 cute but i really really love this wash i just don't like the fit i've never bought jeans off of misguided and honestly i am so disappointed i feel like over the couple of years i've really figured out where to buy the best jeans for thick girls if you want me to do a haul strictly on that i would 100 percent do it because i know like where to get the best jeans but i just thought let me try misguided out for like you know change for once because I, I saw this on the website and i love the wash but i am disappointed <laughs> really really disappointed that like that's just uncomfortable by my hip here i feel so trapped it's also trapped but are they small i don't know i don't know tell me what you think from the viewfinder i didn't think they were they were small when i've tried them on i just wasn't happy with the fit they were just uncomfortable so i don't know what that means <laughs> when i bought those i knew that they may not have fit me so i bought another pair of jeans two riot high-waisted distressed waist denim jean in a size 12 for 22 pound 40 i haven't worn a size 12 item in years <laughs> so even when i'm like sizing up oh my phone fell so even when like i'm buying pants that i feel like won't fit me in my size in a size 10 I never size up i just let the item go but these ones i thought they were so so pretty look at that wash oh denim is actually so beautiful you know with these nude pieces i'm loving so so stunning 
but even the size 12 doesn't fit like it doesn't fit the fit is just so off so 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 off worse than the 10s i don't know if it's because these are non-stretch jeans i got a size 12 because they're non-stretch jeans but oof oof i must stop buying jeans from misguided i'm not trying this again do not recommend if you're a thick girl 100 percent do not recommend you buy jeans from misguided don't do it don't do it there's better places and i'll put you on if you're interested i've got one more item i want to show you guys it's a blazer from bershka i can't really find the receipt for this so i'm not i'll just put the name on the screen or in the comment in the description box below but i got this nude double breasted blazer from bershka i got it in a size extra small to small but yo the fit didn't fit me well at all i get it it's oversized but there's a difference between something looking oversized and it just looking like it doesn't fit at all and this looks like it doesn't fit at all on me you will see tell me what you think but for me no 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 so you see this is what happens to me all the time like sometimes i do go shopping and i hope clothes fit me and then they don't fit this is why i only buy things when i watch um try on hauls mostly they like yeah i try to watch try on hauls when people the same body shape as me so that usually helps me get like a right fit but generally oof yeah no so i will be returning this blazer no 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 so i'm mostly just happy with the top that i got and the shorts Half of the tops and the shorts everything else oh uh, not really not really i think i could do better um yeah if i do buy any more pieces i ordered some stuff from zara but i'm having some issues with the delivery company they delivered my stuff to the wrong address i don't even know why they would deliver it there like and i've been fighting with zara and the shipping company for like over a month now so i don't want to buy any more clothes until that's resolved because obviously that's my money corporations getting richer and chase is just broke <laughs> but um yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you like this video please let me know in the comment section down below your favorite pieces if you will want to buy any of these pieces as well subscribe to my channel it's encouraging for me okay okay Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.